Okay, class, we go to the second part yeah, of uh, chapter 6. That is the graph, yeah, graph of trigonometric function. And we will see the graph for uh, y equals sin x, y equal cos x, and y equal tangent x. Huh? These are the trigonometric function. And the angle that we will use is 0 to 360. Yeah, That is one uh, complete cycle. Huh? Okay, the graph. What kind of graph? It's like something like this lah. Yeah, the electrocardiogram. Uh, but our graph is uh, like the wave. Huh? Uh, something like that. Uh, uh, so, we will see. So, how we draw the graph? We have one apse. Yeah? That is GeoGebra. Yeah? And you can just copy this uh, link to your Google. Yeah? And we can play around with it. And the graph will will be appeared in the apps yeah okay what you should do uh, when i when i show you the graph uh, you observe the shape yeah you observe the shape and you look at the value on y axis uh, when the angle is zero and when the angle increase you look at the maximum value the minimum value and the x intercept yeah, when it uh, cut the x axis, where does it cut the x axis? Yeah, so let's look at the graph. We start with sin, uh, the graph of sin x. So x is the angle, uh, so when the angle increases, see what uh, how is the graph? Okay, this one when the angle increases, you look at the the graph okay look at the shape of the graph first okay 90 degrees like here and when it increase 180 it's like this and then the angle increase become bigger angle so finally when it reach 360 the shape is like this what shape is this it's like s so for sin is uh Related lah, S and sin lah, ada connection. So, that is the graph ah. I repeat, you see, that is the, that is the, the graph. Okay. Okay, that is the shape. And then next, you have to observe what is the maximum value. Uh, what is the maximum value, minimum value. And then, what are the x intercept, everything. So, later we will do it. Eh? So, I just ask you to, to observe first. Okay, next is yeah, cos x. What is the shape? So, when it increases, you see it starts from the value of 1 in the y-axis. Eh? But just now, sin it start with 0. Yeah. Okay, so when 90 degree, it will cut the, the x-axis and then... Yeah, the value will go up. Uh, first, it go down. Now, it's going up. And then, at, 200, 20, at 270, it cut the x-axis. And then, when one complete cycle, there. That is the graph. Yeah. So, we we'll, we'll repeat. The value will uh, decrease. Yeah decrease when the angle increase the value will decrease and then going up after 180 go up yeah the value so uh, this is the shape yeah this is the shape and the maximum value observe where is the maximum value where does it cut the x-axis and uh, y-axis okay okay finally we go to uh, tangent yeah tangent ah what is the sh uh, the shape, the type of graph do you expect? The graph is start from zero, it will go up, the value will go up, and then for 90 degree, you know that tangent 90 is undefined, right? Undefined, it's infinity, no answer. So if it's 90, what do you see here? 
Ah, it will not touch the 90. Huh? No value. So, when 180, uh, you have this graph. Uh, and then, again, after 200, uh, 270, it will not touch the, uh, there's no value, yeah, for 270. Uh, for this one, one complete cycle is like this. So, I repeat. So, this is the graph. Yeah, very different, huh? the graph from the scene cause. Yeah, so this is the graph. So can you remember the shape? I think the shape is easy to remember. It's very different from sine and cosine. We see it all together to now. Okay, the graph, you see? Oh, very interesting. So you can try it in your computer, huh? computer or your your handphone okay this is the graph so now we go to the details yeah i'll explain to you now we go into the details huh, for y equals in x so you know that your graph is like this huh, the s s shape so the maximum value is 1 here and the angle is 90 90 degree yeah when x equal 90 degree and then for the minimum value that is negative 1 here the angle is the angle is 270 yeah 270 and the graph yeah the graph here it will cut it will cut three angles huh? 0 uh, 180 and 360 yeah 0 180 360 and this, this one you call x uh, x intercept yeah this one this a x intercept it cut the x axis yeah and then for intercept of y axis it is uh, here lah, zero yeah it cut the y axis when y is zero okay so it's quite easy not too difficult mm, how to draw it yeah so it start with zero here then the graph is like this okay complete this is 360 and you divide it, in, it into four parts lah, huh? here four parts so this is 90 this is 180 this is 270 yeah so maximum value here is one minimum value is negative one yeah here yeah. minimum value and then it cuts the x x uh, x intercept here. Yeah. This is the x intercept, and the y intercept also here. Yeah. The shape. Okay. Now we go to the cos x. Eh? Cos x. The graph is different. It's like the shape of uh, C lah. But we can say it's like C. Yeah, because it's cause uh, very it's rela related lah, the connection so the maximum value maximum value here is one so the angle that give maximum maximum value is uh, zero lah, okay? zero and 360 here yeah yeah 360 this one hmm? and the minimum value here negative one is the angle the angle of 180 when the x is 180 yeah and x the intercepts of x ah huh? where is it when it 
it cut the x-axis. Where is it? Yeah, here. 1, 2, 90 and 270. But for the sin, sine graph just now, 3, yeah? 3 uh, points that it cut. And for y-axis, uh, y-intercept, yeah? intercept of y-axis is when y equal 1. Yeah? It cut the, cut the y-axis here. Yeah? So the graph is like this, lah, if you want to sketch. Huh? The graph start with 1 here. It will go down here. Ah, so this one is uh, 60, here 0, you just divide into 4 parts, ah. 4 parts, this is 90, 180, this is 270, and this is the maximum value, the minimum value is negative 1, yeah, it's negative 1 here, minimum value, where, when this one, 180 maximum is when the angle is 90 eh, angle is sorry angle is zero yeah here zero and 360 here is it okay hmm you must know how to differentiate it huh? uh, graph y equal tangent x what is the maximum value the graph here if you continue, the, the graph is like this. Uh, it will, it will just um, it is it will go up here, but it will not touch ninety degree. Yeah, so no maximum value. It's undefined, undefined infinity. Sorry, infinity. And also the minimum value. Also this one is it will go down here, but it will not touch. It will not touch uh, ninety. Yeah. You'll not touch 90. So, it's infinity. It's negative infinity. Yeah, negative infinity. Okay, next we look at the uh, x-intercept. Yeah? How many points, uh, how many yeah, points it touches the x-axis? 0, 180, and 360. Yeah, so 0, 180, and 360. And for y-intercept, again, they share here. Huh? This is y-intercept also. And the value of tangent 90 and tangent 270 are undefined. There is no value. There is no point for, uh, for your 90, 90 degree. This is your y. You cannot find your y. Yeah? For your 270 also, you cannot find your your y so it is undefined yeah undefined so it's very special uh, for the tangent graph